We're back in Columbia City at Super 6. In a neighborhood that's known for amazing food, this rustic spot has found a special place in the hearts of locals and visitors alike. Oh, I have been here multiple times. When I meet up with friends in Columbia City, this is usually the go-to place. It definitely brings me back to Hawaii. It just seems amazing to me. I live in this area, so Super 6 is really the restaurant that I wanted to have in my neighborhood. Chef and owner Kamala Saxton has created the perfect spot to get Hawaiian-inspired food and great drinks all in a casually comfortable setting. When we first opened up, it was used as a auto body shop for, I think, 35 years. So we stuck with the, the auto body theme, and even the name Super 6. It was a car that was designed by the first American female auto car designer. The atmosphere is amazing. It gives it kind of like a backyard family feel. It's kind of like you're, you're out there picnicking and getting some awesome Hawaiian food. Love it. So what are we going to make? We're going to do the, the Hawaiian classic, the Loco Moco, okay. and then we're going to do a pork belly musubi. The Loco Moco is Washington State beef. The pork belly is Washington pork. We really try to support local businesses and local farms as much as possible. Yeah, wonderful. The Loco Moco, you will find this on Every menu yeah. in Hawaii, you'll find it's at some 7-Eleven. Uh, <laughs> and it's now made its way to the mainland. Always a better rice, a hamburger patty, eggs, gravy. Yeah. Why is Loco Moco so popular? Is it because of the simple ingredients? I think it's the simplicity of it. And uh, let's be honest, you take gravy and rice any day of the week. You add eggs and uh, beef to it, it's a fantastic meal 12 months out of the year. We start with a bed of rice and add some homemade gravy made from beer, green onions, garlic, soy sauce, and beef broth. We want to be as liberal as possible with this, <laughs> this gravy. Take our Washington State beef patties oh, here. Okay, awesome. So Washington grown beef, we love Washington that. Washington grown beef. And then always two eggs on top. Okay. Sunny side up. And how did you get them to look so perfect? Magic. Magic? Magic. No. Kitchen magic. <laughs> uh. A great pan, high heat, and oil. We add a little more gravy to the side, then onto the garnish. We start with some pickled red onions, green onions, then Korean and Japanese red pepper flakes, and a seaweed sesame mix. Now the best part, tasting. Great job on the plating. <laughs> We're down yeah. to cook tonight, so, um, oh, okay. so we've got a special cook so. in town tonight. Everything about that just screams comfort food. This is mm -hmm. my, this comfort my food. ultimate comfort food. Absolutely. Even when it's 90 degrees, humid mm -hmm. as heck in Hawaii, this is comfort food. It doesn't taste rich, it just tastes good. It's hard to move you know afterwards. I mean? You will feel the richness after we're done. <laughs> yeah. Now onto some pork musubi. Musubi is really, I consider it like a sandwich in mm -hmm. Hawaii. It's, you know, instead of two pieces of bread, we have our bed of white rice, yeah. um, almost like a big sushi. You can eat it for breakfast, lunch, dinner. It's a snack. It sits well at the beach all day. Typically um, in Hawaii, you'll see uh, it with spam, so mm -hmm. seared spam. But today we're going to do pork belly. Okay. We start with a strip of seaweed and lay a musubi mold on top. Next, we add a seaweed sesame mixture onto some rice. And you're gonna take about a handful. It's not a very technical measurement, but uh, <laughs> I'm gonna grab a piece of the uh, Washington State pork belly here. That's awesome. So we marinate our pork belly in a, a kalbi marinade, which is a traditional Korean marinade. We lay the pork into the mold and put the rice on top of it. Then we use the lid of the mold to push down the rice. Now we wrap the whole thing in seaweed and seal it with some water. This is the perfect afternoon snack. It really is. Yep. That pork is amazing. Really tender and tangy. Thank you yeah. so much for these fun yeah, absolutely. Hawaiian dishes. I'm actually super hungry. I'm gonna eat this. <laughs> yeah. To get the recipe for Super 6's Loco Moco and Pork Musubi, visit wagrone.com.